There are various festivals around the world. Some are for celebrating our relationship with Mother Nature, and some are related to interpersonal relationship. Some festivals reflect culture, history, and legends of different regions. Do you know the difference between the East and the West in festival celebrations? Hong Kong Central Library has organized Summer Reading Month with the theme Festivals of the World this year, illustrating selected festivals in four seasons of the year and how different countries and regions celebrate them. Parents and children can explore the values behind these festivals. There are 24 solar terms in lunar calendar under which the natural ecosystem operates. Some festivals celebrate the close relationship between people and Mother Nature, like Spring Festival and Winter Solstice. Also, there are other festivals that remind us to care for our nature. Spring Festival embodies people's wish for a new start, but different regions celebrate it in different ways. Chinese celebrate Spring Festival and the popular traditions are making rice cake and posting Fai Chun to pray for peace. Families will visit each other to say prayers for New Year and children will be very happy as they receive lots of lucky money in these occasions. Japanese wear kimonos and visit shrines or temples during New Year. The Sokran Festival is celebrated in Thailand as the traditional New Year's Day in April each year. The traditional water pouring is meant as a symbol of washing away all their sins and bad luck and give the blessing to each other. Winter solstice is an astronomical phenomenon marking the longest night of the year in the Northern Hemisphere. Chinese families gather for dinner to celebrate Winter Solstice Festival. To encourage us all to care for our mother nature and highlight the importance of conservation for our natural ecosystem, there are festivals like World Wetlands Day, International Day of Forests, and World Water Day. Wetlands are powerful in purifying the environment and have a reputation of kidney of the earth. Around 30% of the earth's land area is forest and trees which can help purify air and water, thus stabilizing climate conditions. Forest is also the habitat of millions and millions of living creatures. Drinking water is also a scarce resource, and the World Water Day reminds us to treasure it. Harmonious interpersonal relationship facilitates a meaningful life. Many festivals celebrate our close relationship with friends and families. Parents are the most important persons in everyone's life. In celebrating the Father's Day and Mother's Day, children usually prepare gifts as a tribute to their parents' devotion to nurturing them. As for Valentine's Day, children can learn to care for others with love and sincerity. The aged are treasures to families. Chengyong Festival, also called Respect the Aged Festival, carries a tradition of hiking on the day and reminds us to respect and care for the aged. International Day of Friendship reminds us to treasure the friendship built during our early days and be patient and thoughtful towards friends. Teacher's Day reminds us to be thankful to teachers who selflessly dedicated themselves to nurturing students. Other than families, teachers, and friends, we need to extend our love to others. International Volunteer Day encourages us to participate in charity work and experience the joy of helping others. There are many festivals in the world that celebrate different cultures of folk legends, historical events, or religion. The Mid-Autumn Festival is a harvest festival celebrated by the Chinese. This festival also carries the legend Goddess of the Moon, and the popular tradition is eating mooncakes. Thanksgiving Day is a national holiday in the United States and Canada. It is celebrated as a day of giving thanks for the blessing of the harvest. The Twin Ung Festival is a traditional holiday originating in China. The festival commemorates the death of the patriotic poet Qu Yuan. The festival activities still well known today are eating rice dumpling and racing dragon boats. Buddha's birthday is a holiday traditionally celebrated in the East, but on different dates in different regions. Whatever the date, Buddha's birthday is a time for celebrating the birthday of its founder, Sakyamuni Buddha, but in different rituals. 
In the West, Christmas is an annual festival commemorating the birth of Jesus Christ. Nowadays, the festival is already a religious and cultural celebration among billions of people around the world. By reading books, we can learn the values and stories behind festivals around the world. World Book Day pays tribute to all authors and encourages us to enjoy reading and thinking. The library set up a reading corner and displayed selected books and electronic resources to facilitate readers' learning of the characteristics and origins of festivals around the world. From now on, we can be thankful and cherish people and everything around us with loving care when celebrating different festivals. The Public Library will organize Summer Reading Month each year and provide a series of engaging activities and thematic exhibition to inspire readers to explore more in different topics. We would like to invite you and your children to join and enjoy all the fascinating activities. To explore more details about the activities of Summer Reading Month, please visit the Public Library website.